everybody? What the fuck is going on? Welcome back to Cooking with Bird Martinez. The one, the only Bird Martinez, motherfuckers. So, first of all, I want to say sorry for not posting. I just been busy, bitch. I cook every day, but you know, when you're gonna like make a video, it's different because you have to like organize yourself and shit. I don't know. It's not that hard, but it's kind of complicated. But yeah, so I'm gonna start posting more. I didn't abandon this channel because I love cooking. That's like my first thing. And um, here we go. So today we're gonna cook one of my daughter's, my daughter's favorite thing to eat. And it's easy for all you moms out there that like are running around and shit. This is the best thing to cook. It's called tacos dorados de pollo. So for this recipe, you could either buy chicken breast from the store that's what i use i use chicken breast and then you boil them and then you you know start deshebrandolo but since i'm in a hurry today because we have a meeting for my daughter mandy she's in honor row and she's gonna have the ceremony today i got some roasted roasted chicken i usually like to get the lemon pepper because it has like more flavor and then i'm gonna go like this you know cut it up in little pieces and then for this, also, you're going to need some tortillas. This is a tortilla that I use, Tortilla Guerrero. I think a lot of people use that. And then you're going to need some cheese. Usually, I use queso um, fresco. But lately, I've been fucking around with this motherfucker right here, panela cheese. And it just has a different texture, and I love it. Also, you're going to need some sour cream. Um, you're going to need some lettuce. And... A little salsa on the side you just need a couple of tomatoes a couple of um chiles verdes and you know whip up a salsa and i think the next video i'm gonna make a salsa so you guys could know how to make a basic ass salsa for any type of dish you know i always have salsa in my fridge so today i'm not making the salsa because i always have salsa in this bitch so let's do this bitch let's get into it motherfucker. chicken basically you're just gonna get the whole chicken and you're gonna, you know, just start making it into little pieces like this. Some people like the skin, some people don't. I used to not fuck with the skin because my mom raised us like that. Like, oh, the skin is bad, the skin is bad. But then I started to kind of love it because it gives it like different type of flavor. So I just use the skin. I've been using it for years. And my kids don't mind it. And then this part, oh, I like this part. I like the, the the light meat or the white meat. I don't know. See? Uh, you're just going to start. I got, I had a chicken from the other day. So that we didn't finish. So that's why I decided to make this dish. Because I was like, oh, I don't want to, you know, throw it away. You got to work with what you have. So see? I'm going to do this. A couple of minutes, bitch. Here we go. You know, don't make them too small. Make them enough so you'll get a good bite when you eat. So I have some salsa, but I want a little bit more. Cause you know, sometimes you think you have enough, but then you're eating and stuff and you need more. So I just got some tomatoes and some chile serrano and I boiled them. And I'm gonna make a little bit more salsa. So throw some garlic in there, garlic clove. And then put the tomatoes in first. And then you're gonna put the chiles in there. These chiles are not even that hot. So I got like six of them. So hopefully it comes out, comes out good. Bitch, all my food comes out good. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> my blender sucks. You motherfuckers how taste your salsa. So you get a spoon, right? And then you get your hand and you go like this. Okay, a little line. Mm, just right has a little hotness but it's enough hotness i don't like salsas that are too damn hot that you can't even fucking taste nothing it's just hotness i'm like oh hell no what the fuck kind of shit is this i like me some bomb salsa that's flavor that adds to the fucking food you know you're gonna get a bunch of tortillas i think there's like 20 and you're gonna put them in the microwave for like 30 seconds because when you're rolling them up this cracks, see? 
and you want them to be flexible so when you roll them up it's just perfect so 30 seconds in the microwave bitch. the final countdown don't mind my my broken ass microwave broken down as fuck but it still works it's all good in the neighborhood now that your tortillas are flexible as fuck we are ready for the next step so you're just gonna get the po the chicken chicken pollo the pollo chicken and you're gonna roll it up so you're gonna put it in the middle and then one side you fold it like this and then the other side you go like that and then this part where it goes like that you leave it down okay and now the other one and the other one motherfucker see and we're just gonna keep doing it until there's no more pollo so that's why I don't heat up a bunch of tortillas at the same time because I know I could run out or whatever. <sighs> eh. There's gonna be some big ones, some little ones, some fat ones, some skinny ones. Just like us. Just like humans. We come in different shapes, sizes, or whatever. Here we go. I'm almost done. <coughs> The kids are around because I know they're hungry. And I already told them, bitch, I'm almost done, I'm almost done. Did you guys hear about James Charles? Oh my goodness, people are like, oh my God, he's so canceled. Motherfuckers, you can't cancel anybody, you ain't God, bitch, shut the fuck up. He's a fucking child, he's 19. Of course he's gonna make mistakes, bitch, what the fuck? This is how they look. This one's ripped, but it's okay. We'll just put the... You're gonna get your masola or whatever you wish to use, and you're gonna put some oil up in this bitch like that. And it's time to put the taco. Put the taco. What's very important is that this part put it facing down, so when it cooks, it like seals that bitch. I don't know if you guys understand, but I'm trying to explain you guys to you motherfuckers as best as I can. Woo! And be careful with your fingers. It's okay if sometimes when chicken comes out, just make sure to take it out. Because then it's gonna cook and it's gonna turn black or whatever. So we can gonna flip the tacos. When they turn a little bit brown like this, that's how you know they're ready because it doesn't open up anymore. Then you're gonna flip it the other way. And then it starts smelling good in the house. I don't know why these motherfuckers are like popping out like that, but it's okay. You know, it doesn't have to be perfect. It's gonna go in your mouth anyways. It doesn't have to look all beautiful. Well, I I try for my food to look okay, decent. But sometimes, I'm like, fuck it. They don't like it, kiss my motherfucking ass. You should be glad I'm cooking for you motherfuckers. Okay, so when you're taking them out, hold them for a little bit like this. So the safety could drain. And then put them in a container like this, bitch. Or whatever you want, you know. Oh, you're there, motherfuckers. So now I'm going to cut my side things, like the things I'm going to use on the side, which are lettuce, tomato, and then I'm going to put a little bit of onion. Most of my family doesn't like onion. I'm the only onion freak. I love onion. I was like, able to eat onion until I did my first communion. And I did my first communion when I was 10 so yeah I think that's why I love onions so much bitch and also I just cut up the queso fresco put it on the side have everything ready bitch it's going down motherfuckers look how pretty that looks I should have done it white in the middle so it could look like a Mexican flag but whatever whatever motherfucker. everybody dresses them up differently I'm just gonna show you how I do it I put some sour cream first. I'm gonna spread it. I spread it like so. And then I add the cheese. Like so. Add some lettuce. I love lettuce too. Add some tomate. And the onion and 
sometimes more cheese but not right now i don't want like too much cheese and out of the sides on top see how pretty that looks how pretty that looks there is no perfect way of doing things if you love to cook bitch or if you don't know how to cook just try it like fuck around and you'll get it so it's now time to test this salud motherfuckers Mmm, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. That's some good ass shit. I'm putting more salsa. Oh, yeah. It just took me like an hour to do all this. Not bad. It's gonna take me like 30 minutes to cook, to clean. But it's all good. I do it for the kids and I do it for my family, bitch. Mmm. It's fucking bomb. But, anyways. Thank you everybody for watching. I've been reading in the comments. I'm gonna try to cook more of what you guys are asking for. But if not, you know, I'll just cook what comes up. But anyways, thank you everybody for watching. Thank you for rocking with little old me. If you fucks with me, I fucks with you, bitch. It's bird gang, 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 motherfuckers. Peace.